Hey guys, in this video, I will tell you the strategy that we have devised to easily clear your VTU M3 examination. This video is for 18 scheme VTU M3 students. First, let's list down the topics which are easier and scorable. Next, you need to practice these topics every day a little bit. You should not wait till your examination. Our strategy is learn just three complete modules. Yes, this will ensure you 60 marks. For extra safety, I will tell you seven more marks question that has asked every year. So what three modules you should learn? Let's look into them. Start with module number one, that is Laplace transform. To score 20 marks in this module, all you need to know is basic differentiation and formulas of Laplace transform. They will ask questions like, find Laplace transform of elementary function. Basically, these functions are trigonometry, exponential or polynomials. Next, find Laplace transform of product of elementary function. These functions are x into e power x or x into sin x or e power x times sin x. Finally, they'll ask you to find Laplace transform of unit function or periodic functions. From these two topics, the same four questions are asked repeatedly every year. To find these questions and free video solution, you can visit our website intuition.org or call to this number. Next part in this module is inverse Laplace transform, which is reverse of Laplace transform. If you can solve the questions of Laplace transform, then inverse Laplace transform is doing everything in reverse. You can score full marks in this part if you just know basic concepts like forming perfect square or solving partial fractions. Next model you need to learn is model number four, that is numerical solution of first order ODEs. There are no prerequisite in this module except algebra. To score full marks, all you need to know is algorithm or steps for each method. There are five numerical methods in this module. Taylor series, Euler's method, RK method, Miles predictor and corrector formula and Adam Bashforth corrector and predictor formula. There will be six questions in a module, right? So all these methods are asked in your question paper. If you want to answer three questions, you just have to learn three methods. But learn one more method to be safe. The next module you need to learn is module number five, that is numerical solution of second order ODE and calculus of variation. The first part in this module is numerical solution of second order ODE. See, this has same strategy as the previous module, but there are only two numerical methods that you need to learn. Number one, RK method of fourth order and second, Miles character and predictor method. Remaining part of module number five is calculus of variation. One definite question they ask every examination is derivation of Euler's formula. The rest of the question they ask from finding extremals of functionals, shape of an hanging change, geodesics of plane surface is straight line. If you learn these topics, you can easily score 60 marks. As a bonus, I will tell you seven more marks question, which is easy to learn at the end of this video. Before that, let me tell you these topics are hard to learn. Because you need a lot of basics and also you should know in which order you need to learn. Don't you worry, we have created an amazing video course which covers all the topics that has mentioned in the video and much more. We also included solution to previous year question paper as well. Do not forget to check it out. Link is in the description. Finally, coming back to the bonus I promised you, it is from module number two. Learn practical harmonic analysis. The question from these topics is easy to learn if you just know the formula. That is seven more marks in your pocket. I hope this video has given you enough confidence. Please do not forget to share this video with your friends.
and like this video and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. Thank you guys. All the best.